The horror of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre will be back on the big screen soon. Leatherface is back, and like a true man of the 80s, he's chasing yuppies and catching them. Tony Clark reports. And action! The terror returns, this time in the netherworld of Christmas lights, bodies, and bones, the home of the Chainsaw family. Okay, go! The victims in the second installment of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre are the well-to-do kids of the 80s, yuppies. And cut. Screenwriter Kit Carson picked his targets while Christmas shopping last year. I was standing there watching these people run by me in these crinkly pastel colors and uh, stacking up clothes. And I said, these people need a chainsaw after them. And that's just what happened. There are bodies and bones everywhere. These ghoulish goodies are the work of special effects director Tom Savini, the creator of the effects for the Friday the 13th and the Day of the Dead films. We've got some uh, foam packaging bits that we dyed red, just look like brains, and we sealed it in there, and that's going to be in there for like another week and a half before we hit it with a chainsaw. It's been 12 years since director Toby Hooper made his first chainsaw movie. That one was done on a budget of $160,000. This one is budgeted at 4.6 million. Chainsaw one, we only had one chainsaw. When the chainsaw broke, we 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 wrapped it for the day and got the chainsaw fixed. Leatherface is back with his mask made from the skin of his victims. In Chainsaw Two, he faces his toughest rival, a former Texas Ranger who packs chainsaws of his own. You see these people, they killed my entire family, made chili out of them in the last picture. So I've been tracking them for 14 years now. And I'm going to get these mad dogs. Audiences around the country will be able to see if he does late this summer in Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2. Tony Clark, CNN, Austin, Texas. This is Headline News. Superstation Profile, Ozzy Virgil, all-star catcher for America's team, the Atlanta Braves. Our dugout's in the first base side over here, and I'm throwing it back to the pitcher, and I threw the ball into the dugout, and two runs scored. <laughs> then I came up the next city and hit a home run and win the game. This team is your team, America's team. Braves versus Dodgers, 10.30 Eastern tomorrow. Turner Broadcasting System. This is the Headline News Network.